Hello friends, welcome to Birens Academy. I am Pramila. Today we will going to discuss about a very famous poet, the novelist, the critic and the professor that is Chinua Achibi. And I will start with his life history and I will tell you the stories, the novels and the poem written by Chinua Achibi. So, today we will begin the lessons with the beautiful quotations given by Chinua Achibi. That is, if you don't like someone's story, write your own. So let's begin. That is Chinua Achibi. Chinua Achibi born in Nigeria in 1930. So he born in Nigeria in 1930. Chinua Achibi Nigeria in 1930. He was a novelist, poet, critic and a professor. His first novel Things Fall Apart is published on 1958. Okay. So try to remember all the important writings and the publications and the writers. Understood? And that is very much important for your examinations. And you are going to give the examinations that is a, a SSB examination for the plus 3 level. So it is very much important to remember all the writings of the writers and their publications okay so his and his first publication that is the first novel which is things fall apart and most of the time this question has already repeatedly came so try to remember it the kochino achibi nigeria 1930 she was a poet thile critic thile a professor bhi thile atanga first novel thila things fall apart jote ki published hetla 1958 okay he is world famous for his african trilogy tangaro african trilogy pai boli ki se pro world famous thile se trilogy re kon kon thila ko tin ta writings thila that is things fall apart which published on 1958 no longer at ease published on 1960 and error of god is published on 1964. So these are included in his trilogy. H.E.B. novels focuses on tradition of Igbo society. So when you will read about the Chinua H.E.B.'s novels, you will find the main focus. That is the main focus about the tradition of Igbo society. Okay. Igbo society, Tanko Upurehi. So, I have written writings in the same way. I have written writings in the same way. I writings in the same way. I have written writings in the same way. I have written H.E.P. has been called the father of modern African writing. So, try to remember this one that Chinua H.E.P. is called as the father of modern African writing. Question as per who is regarded as the father of modern African writings. So, you have to mention that is Chinua H.E.B. And try to remember the time period that is 1930 to 2013. Okay. This is the time period of Chinua H.E.B. 1930 to 2013. And we will see his important writing. That is, Things Fall Apart. Okay. It is published on 1956. Things Fall Apart, writing. Zuta ki published in 1956. And the, uh, it is also, the H.E.B. had already chosen the title for the book first. Okay. Then he changes the title. That is, he first thought to give the title that is, The Specification of the primitive tribe. Lawyer Nigeria. Okay. 
the pacific of the primitive tribes of the lo lower nigeria first chino hb thought to give the title to things for leopard okay then he changes the title and it is a post colonial historical novel understood the things fall apart is a post colonial historical novel and the title of this novel mostly influenced and it came from the very famous poet that is w b eats poem the second coming eda bhi mone rakhibo je first kon thila things fall apart se deba purboru je writer bhabi thile chino achi bhi जे ताको द पेसीफिक अफ द प्रिमिटिव ट्राइब अफ द लोअर नाइजेरिया बोले देवे यहाँ गोटे पोस्ट कॉलोनियल हिस्टोरिकल नॉवेल थिला आ नॉवेल मानने कि लाइन्स रू डाइव हो जोटा कि डब्ल्यू बी इट्स रईटिंग दैट इज डब्ल्यू बी वाई ए टी एस ओके डब्ल्यू बी इट्स रईटिंग द सेकेंड कमिंग द सेकेंड कमिंग ओके ये मन रखे तुम क्वेश्चन आसपा तो फर्स्ट रईटिंग कौटा था चेज कले फर्स्ट टाइटलसटा से कौन दे मसीहार से पब्लीश होता कौ ये पब्लीश होता आईटा कौ नवेल ओके इट इज ए पोस्ट कलोनियल हिस्टोरिकल नवेल अंडरस्टुड आईटा कौ रईटर्स पोएम रु इनफ्लुएंस होता बा डबल बी इट्स कर कौ रा पोएम रु इनफ्लुएंस होता एमती बहुत गुड़ाए क्वेश्चन से फ्रेम हो जाऊँगी अंडरस्टुड सेमती द न लंगर एट इज इज पब्लीश अन् नाइन सिक्सटी एंड द एर अफ गड इज पब्लीश अन् नाइन सिक्सटी फोर अंडरस्टुड एंड वी विल सी सम अफ द सर्ट स्टोरी दैट इज रिटर्न बाय चिन्हुआ एच वि मेरेज इज ए प्रिमिटिव एफर्स पब्लीश अन् And Dead Man's Path, published on nineteen fifty-three. The Civil Peace, published on nineteen seventy-one. And the one more writing is there that is Girl at War. Girl at War. This is also his short story. Okay. And we will see. That he has all he has also sorry, and we will see his important children's book. That he was also very much famous for the children's books. That is Chicky and the River, which published on nineteen sixty six. The Chicky and the River was published on nineteen sixty six. The flute published on nineteen seventy four. The drum, which published on nineteen. सेवेन्टी एट बुझिपार सर्ट स्टोरी जमी थी द मेरेज इज ए प्रिमिट एफर्स डेडमेन स्पाथ सिविल वर ए सब तरह कौन सर्ट स्टोरीज थी सर्ट स्टोरीज मन रख नवेल्स मन रख चिलड्रेन्स बुक भी सी बहुत फेमस थे चिलड्रेन बुक चिकी एंड द रिवर द फ्लूट ड्रम ओके आ गए थी तरह चिलड्रेन्स बुक हाउ The leopard got his clon. Okay, how the leopard got his clon? A good idea. Hello, thank you. Children's book. Okay, so this is very important topics, and this is all about Chinua HIV. I hope you understood the concept of Chinua HIV. and uh, that is uh, you are free to attend the classes and you are free to join the class and we are providing the classes uh, on the paid basis and that uh, i will give you the number you can contact to this number that is 9040 7500 9040 7500 okay 9040 7500 नाइन फाइव टू फाइव एट बीरेन सार नंबर तुम ये नंबर रे कांटेक्ट कर पेड क्लासेस स्टार्ट जाऊँगी आ सब कोर्स गुड़ाक बिफोर टाइम सब कंप्लीट हम 
आउ से तुम यू कैन सी द डेस्क्रिप्शन बक्स फर द फर्दर डिटेल्स एंड इफ यू हैव एनी कैंड ऑफ डाउट्स रिगार्डिंग द जॉइनिंग प्रोसीजर एंड द अबाउट द सिलेबस स्ट्रक्चर एंड एनी एनी कोर्स इनफर्मेश यू कैन कंटैक्ट टू नाइन जीरो फोर जीरो सेवेन फाइव नाइन फाइव टू फाइव नंबर यू विल गेट ऑल द क्लियर अबाउट ऑल योर डाउट्स ओके आई होप यू अंडरस्टूड दिस कंसेप्ट इन ए वेरी क्लियर मैनर थैंक यू फॉर द क्लास एंड थैंक यू